If you want to go ahead and generate a PowerPoint slide using DeepSeek, then you can utilize this trick. For example, you can go ahead and say, make a PowerPoint slide on 10 uh, fruits beneficial for health. Uh, just like this. So I said make a PowerPoint slide on 10 fruits beneficial for health. Make 10 slides, uh, 10 slides with one fruit mentioned in each and give this to me as a visual basic script that I can run as a module in Microsoft PowerPoint right here just like this so if I were to go ahead and then send this so I actually asked for a visual basic script that I can actually run as a module in Microsoft PowerPoint once you do that the deep seek right now at the time of recording cannot actually create a slide but if you were to ask for a VB uh, script right here then what happens is that it will generate out this code accordingly right here so you can see that this is what you have VBA script for PowerPoint and then you can see that this is what you have so you need to wait for the code to actually finish generating right here just like this and once it's uh, it finishes generating you can simply go ahead and copy this and then in PowerPoint you can go ahead on to the developer mode if you don't have developer mode enabled in PowerPoint, simply right click on the ribbon and then go to the customize ribbon section right here and enable the developer mode from here and press OK and you'll get this. So now if I were to go ahead and choose Visual Basic, I can go around and let's say for example, insert a module right here and paste that code. So once you go ahead and do that and hit the run button, what happens is that it'll simply create the slide accordingly right here, just like this as you can see. And that is how you can go ahead and generate PowerPoint slides using DeepSeek easily. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.